welcome Virgos. I want to say thank you for being here. Thank you for being back. This happy birthday Virgos. This is wonderful. You're in your seasons and I'm glad to come in and bring you this wonderful, wonderful alignment of energies. So Virgos, what is happening and transpiring? This is your year. This is your solar year Virgos. And you are dealing with finding out some um, secrecy or some sort of a situation um, with a whole lot of money in this year. So as we look at your T crossing, um, it's money to do with uh, um, someone you are in a relationship with. Um, some divorce could be the loss. Um, Jealousy over a whole lot of money and it has to do with a relationship that went bad It could be a family member because the ace of cups there is no love I see you standing strong and uh, um, Creating your own wealth and stability Then we see some of you are leaving some sort of a situation behind Remember that this reading is from the day after your birthday until the day before your birthday in 2021 okay and you're going to be dealing with all of these energies once you were born 24 until the 30th of um august um this is your solar year energy each and every person is going to be affected to um by all of these energy um that is here in place so virgos be aware of this be aligned with this um, know what is coming up, know what is transpiring because you're dealing with a, a lot of issues, okay? So, if you were born um, on the 24, 25, 26, 27, you are going to start this energy with uh, um, the one month with this energy, the next month with this energy, third month, fourth month, fifth month, sixth month, seventh month. Um, then you come back at the eighth month, nine month, tenth month, eleven month. 12 months. It's as if you're working out a lot of issues um, and people are going to be um, there helping you and around you. So money is going to be the center. This year is a year where you're going to be rebuilding your financial stability. There is going to be a lot of opportunities that is coming up. So Virgos, be open for this. Some of you could be dealing with a scorpion woman. And I see justice could be coming up on the scorpion woman. They're finding out the truth about the scorpion woman. So be aware of this. So what we see is a year of um, financial gains. Okay. Um, this is about a gains. So it's a year of financial gains. So let's look at the people who were born on the 24th. If you were born on the 24th, I see you're dealing with some sort of an issue and situation with relationships. Now, it could be issues with your parents, issues with your partner, issues with your kids, issues with family member. Some of you could be connecting in a family business and there's a whole lot of issues that is going on. Some of you, your marriage um, could break up. However, this is happening and transpiring. There can be some sort of a transition where some of you are going to be thinking about um, turning your backs on your family and moving forward. And however, this sort of an energy is coming up. So be aware of this because that sort of instability could be leaving. Some of you could be leaving a partnership, a business partnership. Some of you could have created some sort of a business partnership. And now you're thinking about uh, this situation, this person, and you could be um, deciding to make some sort of a move where you're going to be um, leaving some issue situation and moving forward and some of you um you're going to be gaining a whole lot if you started a business um in this year where is uh, after your birth your birthday to your next zodiac birthday um 2021 you could um start a business and this business is going to be doing very very well for you as we look at the people who were born on the 25th you're dealing with some sort of a issue either with your mom or either with your mother-in-law. So that sort of an issue could be coming up. The most important thing is that you're going to be building on your financial stability, however this is going on. I see building on the financial stability, 
I see positive alignment of energies between you. Um, some heartbreaks could be coming up uh, for you and your partner. Um, you young people between the ages of 18 and 45 could be having some sort of a heartbreak um, with um, your um, your child's mother or your wife. Some um, problems between you and your mom is definitely coming up. Some of you young people could be having some sort of a issue and situation with your materialistic world. So be aware of this. So as we look at the people who were born on the um, 24, 25, 26, I see a new start is going to be coming in for you if there was some sort of an issue with your marriage relationship friendship um i see you're going to be having some sort of a new start i see people are going to be um whatever that was transpiring where you have withdrawn yourself from some sort of a friendship and that sort of a thing i see um these people are going to be trying to return in your life some of you could be dealing with some sort of an issue where um, emotional issues that you're dealing with that has to do with either relationship, friendship. However, this is coming up and transpiring, but I see you're going to be overcoming this. Some of you new love, some of you who were not in a relationship, new love is going to be returned and it's going to be really wonderful and really powerful. As we look at the people who were born on um, the 27. Um, you are having the energy of uh, your enemies. You're seeing your enemies in this year because you're going to be some um, creating some sort of a financial abundance and wealth for yourself. And I see a whole lot of jealousy is going to be coming at you. Secrecy about a whole lot of money that has to do with either family or your partner or your ex-partner. But a whole lot of secrecy. Some of you, jealousy could be coming at you um because um you have created a whole lot of wealth for yourself or wealth was um left for you so be aware of the alignment of energy that is coming up because if you notice you have money but no love so some of you could be financial stability but there is no love um there is no relationship um there is no love the love that is coming in is not pure love because it is only based on materialistic um, um stability so I always advise people to order a birthday reading because when you order a birthday reading, it's programmed on what is coming up for you. And you also have uh, the astro clock that shows you in all your 12 houses what is going to come up. So it is very good for you to order a birthday reading. It's not too late because you're coming up to your birthday. So you can order it um, a month before um, or on your birthday, but, but a lot of people always order it a month before or a week before their birthday. So it's not too late for you guys to do that. So love is um, in the reverse for you guys because it's as if you are financial stable, but you, you're realizing that people around you is only around you for your money. And you're going to be um, on top of your game and seeing that. So, then we are looking at the people who were born on the 28th and we have the energy of death and transition. And this is more of a phase of transition. If you notice, you have your own energy vibration where something is going to be leaving your life that is going to be making you feel out of balance and you need, you're going to be seeing the, the truth. So whatever is leaving your life is going to be creating some form of imbalance, but truth is going to be revealed and you're going to be definitely, definitely seeing the truth as to what has been happening and transpiring. So you're going to be realizing um, the issues, the situation, the obstacles uh, that could be coming up and uh, where these sort of a situation and issues are coming from and how you can resolve um, these sort of a, a situation that is coming in your life. Because a whole lot of truth is going to be um, seen, and a lot of you who are in a relationship with a Libran, you're going to be ending this relationship or this marriage. So a whole lot of you could, could be finding yourself having divorce and ending relationships, marriage, or legal custody battle, and that sort of a thing. So be aware of then as we look at the people who were born on the 29th, you have a fire energy where you're dealing with people 
um, authority and you're finding out about some false height and deceptiveness, you got it on time. The thing about it is that you guys are going to be really receiving um, the news and then you're going to be, um, um, you know, getting getting um, um, an end of it on time and um, um, holding off whatever um, that was coming at you because this is going to be um, positive because you're holding off the false height, the deceptiveness that was coming at you and this is going to be good because I see that some so um, people in oratory could be you or people in oratory is going to be finding out that a whole lot, a lot of money was stolen and they're going to be trying to regain this money. Um, however it came up, however it transpired, people in oratory is going to be seeing that there was some sort of a false play in order to create um, um, more money. And I see that they're going to be stepping on it directly and 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 um and stopping it and showing up and for some of you and helping some of you out because they realize the false height that is being created over um some sort of a false height in order for people to get more money. And I see people in authority is seeing the truth and is um um putting down their foot uh, on it in order for it. Uh, to be um, resolved in the correct order. And this is going to be good. So wonderful alignment of energy um, that is coming up and how things are being resolved um, by people in authority. And it could be also yourself. Um, they are really seeing what was happening and what was transpiring. Um, so this is going to be good. Last but not least, the people who are born on the 30th, you're going to be seeing some sort of a false height and um, 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 and, and deceptiveness um, um, with a Libran. And um, I, I see some of you are going to be standing your ground against this Libran, whoever this person is, because the light is shed. It's as if some of you, Virgos, is going to be shedding light on a corporation and a company that has created some lies, deceptiveness, and false height, and a Libran and an Aquarius is connected to it, and it's a huge corporation, and you're shedding light on this. Then we're going, you're going to be shedding light on a Pisces, Cancer, Scorpion woman. I see that this woman has some legal issue, whatever the issue is and the situation is. I definitely see that this um, lady have some sort of a legal issue and some sort of a problem. So however this is coming up and transpiring, I really see um, that some of you are going to be showing up an elderly lady, whoever this person is. Now, some of you could be your mom or some of you, this woman could be just someone who comes in your world. So you got to be aware of who this person is and how this person is aligning you and your energies and situation in your world because whoever this person is and whatever is transpiring, this person could not be on, um, you know, doing the right thing and being on the right part because uh, they are coming up with some sort of a legal issue. Some of you could be um, having some conflicts uh, with a scorpion woman if you're married or you could be divorcing a scorpion woman. This is coming up uh, and um, you're going to be finding out something the scorpion woman is going to be taking you down for everything that you have and I see you're standing your ground and said no honesty is honesty no I'm not giving up all of this and you're right because whatever it is and whoever this person is is being very very deceptive and I see that you're going to be making some sort of a change and standing your ground and this is going to be good and it's going to be a year of financial stability but also emotions it's going to be a very, very emotional year. So you got to be aware of what is happening and transpiring. And people are going to be cutting back on the false height and deceptiveness that has been happening and transpiring. And this is going to be good. So Virgos, happy birthday again. Please like and share these videos. It is not too late um, for you guys to hold a personalized reading. It is um, it's good to order a personalized reading because 
what happens and what transpire is that um, you will be aligned with the correct energies and it is all about being capable and aligned with the correct energies a lot of you there is some sort of a situation where some of you are going to be moving back um, in with your mom I see that there was some sort of issues you um, Virgo man was having with your brothers or your sister um, I see that you're going to be um, you're not hoping to work on a marriage or a relationship and I see some of you are going to be deciding to leave this marriage or this relationship and these group of people I see huge heartbreak um, is coming up for some of you then when we look at this heartbreaks um, um, heartbreaks and people are going to just walk away I see some money um, where friends have stolen um, will be returned I see a whole lot of um, you know hate is coming at you it doesn't really matter um you know it wasn't theirs in the first place and i see all of this hate is coming at you but it really doesn't matter so let it go and i see you're going to be moving forward in a very very positive way i see um money the um what whoever um money was stolen from i see people in power or in a bank or in a financial institution is going to be finding out and I see a lot of hate is going to be coming at you, but I see that the situation will be balanced out where a corporation institution is going to be returning this money to you because they find out the lies and deceptiveness and how an Aquarian and Librian have created some sort of a false way in order to accept some sort of a money. Uh, um, some of you who are having issues with corporation institution I see um, if you had an ex boss that was a scorpion I see they're going to be finding out what this person have done and they're going to be making sure that the money is returned to you because they realize that this lady has transferred the money to a Libran or a Libran has opened an account in your name and transferred the money to this Libran I see this is going to come to an end because a government institutes organization is going to be seen the lies and deceptiveness of the scorpion woman and they're going to be coming down on her they're going to be coming down on her very hard so you could be divorcing this lady whoever this lady is um you could be divorcing this lady it could be an ex-boss for some of you or you could be divorcing this lady so men be aware if you're divorcing a scorpion woman they're going to be finding out some false eye. some of you are dealing with an aquarian man or some sort of an investigation and there's going to be some false height and deceptiveness there's a whole lot of jealousy that is coming to you young men and um, the jealousy is coming in from your friends so be aware and alert of this uh, because that is transpiring I see a lot of friends is coming and want to connect with you but they don't want to be friends they're only connecting with you for your materialistic stability the seven of water is here so a lot of new opportunities um golden opportunities is going to be coming your way so open up for the energies because um this year for you virgos is going to be good there has been some ups and downs um some issues and situation but it's going to be a good year i love you guys please like and share these videos and i'm saying namaste until next time